Flowplast's British Standard Kite Marked Ring Seal, Push Fit and Solvent Weld Soil Systems are compatible with all other UK manufacturers. They're simple to install, even for a complete novice. Installation is easy. For replacement, first remove the existing soil stack and fittings, starting at the top of the stack and working your way down. At this stage, you will have previously installed the internal fittings leading to the new stack on the outside. Install the new soil stack in the reverse order of the removal of the old stack, working from the ground to the top. A brand new installation should also be carried out in this way. Next, plan out where all the fittings will go. Begin by offering up the first fitting. In this instance, it's often advisable to install an access fitting at the base, which is good practice to aid rodding. Measure and mark the correct length on the pipes. Cut the pipes to the correct lengths. Ensure all the cut lengths of pipe are chamfered to roughly a 45 degree angle. Use a silicone lubricant to make the fitting easier. Fit the pipe or socket brackets at a maximum of 2 meters on vertical pipe and a maximum of 1 meter on horizontal pipe. Then using two 40 mm by 5.5 mm round head brass or zinc screws, Attach the first bracket to the pipe. Next, establish the joining point of any horizontal and vertical pipes that may be required. Then measure and install the connecting branch and pipes, securing with Flowplast's pipe or socket brackets. Continue installing the soil stack following the same procedure until you're ready to install the ventilation section. The ventilation pipe open to the outside should finish at least 900 millimeters above any opening into the building that's within 3 meters of the soil stack. Alternatively, fit Flowplast's external air admittance valve. This will allow you to install an external soil pipe within 3 meters of any opening, and it can terminate at a minimum of 200 millimeters from the wet entry point. If a waste pipe fits to the soil stack, then use our range of boss pipes. In this instance, the strap-on boss is used. First cut a 54 mm hole into the soil pipe. Solvent weld around the hole and the flange of the strap-on boss. The word top is embossed on the fitting to show the correct way up. The strap-on boss has a built-in fall of 2.5 degrees. If the push fit system is used, then simply push fittings together. If solvent fittings are used, then follow the procedure on screen. Measure, mark and cut the waste pipe to the required length. Mark, drill and fix supporting clips for the waste pipe as required. To complete the installation, use a cement mix to make good any holes. A range of WC connectors are also available to join your toilet to your soil stack. Once your installation is complete, please dispose of old or unwanted items, including pipes and fittings, in a responsible manner. For more product info, visit www.flowplast.co.uk.